Dr. Alberto Meloni shares, I also explained that further vision changes can take place after phagic Iowa implantation. Cataracts can develop, and this will probably necessitate explantation of the phagic IOL, removal of the cataract, and implantation of a pseudo phagic IOL. This is an important issue and must be made clear, although the development of cataract seems to be quite low with the latest EVO Vision ICL model by Star Surgical. I also note that refractive surprise can occur, and this may necessitate exchange of the phagic IOL for a different lens power. Presbyopia is also described so that patients are prepared for the gradual loss of reading vision in their 40s. The last point I try to emphasize during informed consent is that patients may perceive some glare and halos, especially in the early post-operative period. This will generally get better, but some issues can remain.